Android, how to implement SSL certificate pinning in a React Native app. In the age of increasing cybersecurity threats, it is crucial to ensure that your app's data remains secure. One effective method to do this is by implementing SSL certificate pinning. This guide will guide you through the essential steps to integrate SSL certificate pinning in a React Native app running on Android, helping you guard against man-in-the-middle MITM, attacks. What is SSL certificate pinning? SSL certificate pinning is a security technique used to bolster the SSL-TLS certificate verification process in your application. Instead of relying solely on the CA, certificate authority, verification during every SSL-TLS handshake, pinning allows your application to check that the server's certificate matches a known, predefined one. This ensures that your app communicates only with a trusted server, blocking unauthorized agents even if they have a valid CA-issued certificate. Prerequisites Before proceeding with the implementation, ensure you have the following. A React Native app set up in your development environment. Basic knowledge about SSL-TLS certificates. Access to the server certificate. Steps to implement SSL certificate pinning in React Native. Step 1. Install Network Security Configuration Library. First, you need to add a Network Security Configuration file. This file lets you define specific security requirements for network traffic, such as specifying trust anchors. Create a new XML file named network underscore security underscore config.xml inside the rest slash XML directory of your Android project. If the XML directory does not exist, you will need to create it. Replace your domain.com with your server's domain and base64 underscore encoded underscore fingerprint underscore here with the base64 encoded SHA-256 fingerprint of your server's SSL certificate. Step 2. Link Network Security Configuration in Android Manifest. Next, reference your Network Security Configuration file in the Android Manifest.xml to ensure that it is used by your application. Add the following line inside the application tag in your Android Manifest.xml file. Step 3. Install third-party library, optional. For advanced scenarios where you need more control, you can use third-party libraries like React Native SSL pinning. This is optional but can provide enhanced features and ease the complexity. Install the package using npm or yarn. Or Step 4. Initialize SSL pinning in your React Native code. After having the library installed, you can initialize SSL pinning in your React Native component. In the certs array, include the name of your PEM or SER certificate without the file extension which should be placed inside res slash raw or assets directory. Conclusion Implementing SSL certificate pinning in your Android React Native app strengthens your app security against man-in-the-middle attacks. By following the steps outlined in this guide, you can ensure that your app connects only to trusted servers, safeguarding your sensitive data. Always stay updated on security best practices to maintain the integrity of your application.